Nintendo might be basking in the glory of its latest Zelda title, but that hasn't stopped questions about its aging Switch console and what the video gaming giant has in store next. The Japanese company said on Thursday it had sold more than 3.9 million Switch units in the April to June quarter. That exceeds sales in the same period last year. Why? The runaway success of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, which went on sale in May. Founder of Kantan Games consultancy, Sir Kantoto. It's very, very critical for Nintendo to have so-called system sellers like uh, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, for example, on their platform. Uh, so these are games where people go out uh, to uh, to buy the hardware just just in order to be able to play that that that, that specific game. Tears of the Kingdom shipped 18 and a half million units in the first quarter and has been almost universally praised. It has a score of 96 out of 100 on reviews aggregator Metacritic. Investor sentiment has also been buoyed by the breakout success of the Super Mario Bros. movie, which currently leads this year's global box office ranking. Nintendo said sales in its business related to mobile and intellectual property tripled to more than $221 million thanks to the film, which also helped drive sales of the game featuring the titular mustachioed plumber. First quarter operating profit leapt 82% on a year earlier, with sales of first-party software at record highs. Analysts said the market, however, was now focused on the timing of the successor to the Switch, now in its seventh year on the market. Really high time for Nintendo to uh, to introduce um, uh, new hardware, also to support uh, games from third parties. And I believe that uh, uh, this is uh, uh, the last uh, year uh, where we um, where we still uh, play only uh, the Switch from Nintendo. I think that the company is going to actually release a new uh, piece of hardware um, uh, in the next uh, in the next calendar in, in 2024. Toto is among those suggesting the next platform allow more third party games. In the meantime, however, Nintendo fans and investors are looking ahead to upcoming titles Detective Pikachu Returns and Super Mario Bros. Wonder, both due for release later this year.